It's true. Different. Yeah. yeah. The same. That's a nice shirt, though. Oh, but you can, though. I do. I do. I do. I do. <laughs> all my shirts now, they moved up. Because your shoulders got all big. Because my shoulders, because I'm not going to wear legs. They're an issue. This is what you're doing. Wait, at night, it's all your hair. Oh, how much is your secret? Oh, you know. These bad boys. Don't worry. I'm going to wear stones. Relax, Ron. Mike's Ron. The biggest forearm and calves in this fucking city. Shit. All right. That's on. Oh, I was gonna do you need to point the way. Yeah. <laughs> you got the beach ball. Right. So <laughs> Marcus couldn't be a part of this podcast because because um, he lost to me. No, no, it's, okay. it's, it's fired. I mean, fired, there's a lost, but it's like his uncle passed away. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, he, um, that was a tasteless joke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but we could also fire him. No, we fired yeah. him too at the same time. <laughs> fired. But on the day you, you find out you got a, a lost like, one, all of a sudden it's like, you're fired. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we fired him. I was not a part of his decision. I love how you're like, we. <laughs> yeah, we, we, we. Is this, this your phone? Yeah, I see all mine. Oh, I can do some, um, can do some uh, research. research on Chris Chan. We talked about this guy, Chris Chan. Who the hell is that? Coolest guy in the world. I said the same thing. Is it? Yeah. yeah. yeah it's YouTube, YouTube. Creator. Not coolest guy. No, no, no. no it's terrible. Actually, coolest terror. girl now. Coolest no. girl now. Coolest Christina girl. is a guy that turned into a girl. Okay. Transitioned into a girl, but then later uh, had allegations and lost. Not lost, but allegations. Or got arrested for incest, what? having wow. sex with her mom. He was like seventy nine. What? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. So yeah. we still think he's cool. Yeah, it's awesome. He, <laughs> he's, 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 he's awesome. <laughs> the worst thing in the world. Like, he has his top five ball. Uh, well, he was his mom. It was his real mom. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, it's yeah, his, his real mom. mom. Smashing his real mom. His cool. real mom as he's transitioned into a woman. Mm. Um, but, yeah, so he... he was, Somebody, like, he was going in or was he sitting? I don't know. I was there. there. <laughs> I, 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 an hour and out. A little bit of scissor. Kind of went in. A little shit, scissor? Wait, was it? Was it like, I'm in? I don't think he... I don't think... I don't think it did. Was it a combo? Maybe a combo. Huh? What was we don't know how far in the transition he was. I don't know. I don't know. The, but, well, Can you hear a dick and a penis at the same time? Uh, a dick and a penis, yes. A dick and a vagina at the same time? Uh, I, th- I think he so. can. I think, I think, I, I think it's possible. Totally, yeah, I think it's possible. I, mean, I think it's just like... You can impregnate yourself, too. Imagine? Wow. No, because you can't have eggs. You can't have ovaries. No, no. That's the only thing you can't have. You can have a vagina, but you can't have uh, a oh, God, you, can't push any, you can't put anything past anybody nowadays. Plus, you... science, science. That's what I mean. It's, it's, like, like, uh, it it's like the movie uh, where Arnold Schwarzenegger, he got pregnant. Oh, uh, yes, yes. You remember that? <laughs> no, not no. Twins. Uh, oh, yeah, what was twins. that movie? Wait, yeah. What was oh, that my movie? God. It was at the same time. What made okay? Here's my thing. What made Arnold? What that script got dropped on Arnold's desk or his agent desk? What made Arnold say, "Yeah, the I'll, check. I'll do the, it." The check. You think so? Yeah, that guy was making so much money back then. If, yeah. I mean, whatever would be equivalent of today's money for like the oh, I don't yeah. know, like a brand well, or some crap. Intersex is a group of conditions in which there is a discrepancy between the external genitals and the internal genitals, the testes and ovaries. The older term for the condition is hermaphroditism. Wait, but that doesn't answer my question. And then it says this is a very rare condition in which tissue from both the ovaries and testicles is present. The child may have both parts of a male and female genitals. Yeah, it says you can. Can I both? But then the, the, this thing says, this is weird. It says from, in, from Junior. Junior. Act, no human. <laughs> junior. junior. Yeah. Are yes. pregnant? Right after, okay, I'm sorry. Junior is sandwiched between True Lies and Terminator 2. Love it. <laughs> How is that? <laughs> I love it. So and he was bored. And and was comedy to after doing Junior, he's like, I have to regain my manhood. Yeah, <laughs> Terminator yeah, yeah, yeah. Terminator 2. They were, the movie wasn't even in the I don't, I don't <laughs> think it's manhood was the question. They're like, Yo, here's, here's five mil. <laughs> I just need you to play oh. a pregnant man. Austrian. <laughs> and then I was going to be the Dito and Twins. Yeah. So like, that was great was movie. Yeah. To make, that was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> that movie got me in trouble as a kid. Twins? Because, yeah, I was watching Twins in the living room with my cousin. 
and we're watching Twins, and then it came up in the scene when they were in the motel. That's when Arnold was making out with that girl. Uh, and my um, grandfather walked into the living room at that. It just happened anytime you watch anything. There's a sixth sense for that stuff. Walked in at that time, and he looks at the TV, and he looks at me, and he was like, is this what you watch? And I'm like, I didn't know this. <laughs> it was just the one TV in the house. the one TV in the house. It's the one so TV like, in the house. <laughs> oh, the house. So one time so. you don't have the remote, and this is what I'm watching. <laughs> Yeah, what kind of TV was it? Was it one that's like a dial kind of TV? You don't even know for the little box. I had box. Yeah, My granddad yeah. had one of those really old boxes that was basically the size of a refrigerator. Yeah. And uh, you had the, the the panels on the side. I had the yeah, old uh, HBO yeah. box, number the old HBO yeah. box yeah. sat on top. Yeah. And had the one little guy. He yeah. also had the thing where he had a he had an old TV and he was too lazy to get rid of that old TV, so he just put the new TV on top. Right on top. And then he put the other new TV on top of that. <laughs> so it was just like three. It, so was, like, it was like a big ball. box and then it was like the smaller yeah. TV. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it was, took a, it was it basically used that as a dresser too, because it was so goddamn big. So yeah. Yeah. On top I have it. a little like wooden TV. <laughs> yeah. It was like a whole big flat top, and you would just like a DJ tournament on top of all this stuff. Those are those are awesome, and I remember it would take like twenty minutes for the image to like fully like you know light up the yes, screen. Well, you used to get that little pop in the middle for it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then when you turn it off, <laughs> it's just a green line. We don't even know that we. Dying from radiation. Speaking of twins, there was supposed to be another twin movie, which was supposed to be Eddie Murphy. Yeah? And a white dude? No. <laughs> Eddie DeVito <laughs> and Arnold Schwarzenegger, they weren't twins. It was triplets. Triplets with Eddie Murphy. <laughs> Eddie Murphy and, was the And that's why I never asked. <laughs> it was just like, nah, that's... Oh, that's that would have been hilarious. Like, that would have been, no, that that been great. No. <laughs> we were all been like, I mean, what else can you possibly? So we finding Eddie Murphy's mom, <laughs> and then we all realized that the scientist or the doctor was a fucking piece of shit. Stop impregnating all these women. Wasn't it all different, like moms, or was it? No, it was one mom. It was one mom. One mom. And all the sperm. All these, yeah, yeah. And here's all these eggs. And no, I think I think sperm. what happened was yeah. Arnold. Oh, here's all my sperm. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I think I think in, in the movie it was Arnold got all the nutrients first from the mom, and that's why DeVito came out the way he was. There are twins like that, though. That's what I tell my brother. I was like, listen, I got all the nutrients. <laughs> <laughs> Three twins? No. <laughs> my brother's like, well, he's doing the leftover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's doing the leftover. My brother's shorter. He's a little uh, pudgier. So, he's like, oh, sorry. <laughs> No, it's funny because like you, you see twins like that. Of course, you see identical twins, but it's like okay. But there's always a twins where it's like, how are you guys even remotely related? Like you know, like have you seen those? Oh, like like uh, what do you call that? A girl and boy twin. Well, that no, no but, uh, I mean, no, but sometimes you the same sex where it's like like a really hot girl and then just like. I think that's just all uh, there's much like, style and frumpiness, man. I mean, one cares, one does. <laughs> no, but like a different lifestyle. You saying they look different lifestyle? Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. No, but I'm talking about like even physical attributes prior yeah, to yeah, that. You could have one with posture, and the other one just fucking all around the hump. Like it, it's yeah. just, I think it's just the. Well, uh, I find weird though. Probably look the same. I don't know if I would ever want a twin. Oh, no. I think that would fucking creep me out. See, looking at yourself the entire time. Not the entire time. But like growing up, you just look at yourself all the time. You. Different. I think they have like mental telepathy for sure. I think so. There's yeah. a connection. I think, yeah, twins yeah. do have that where they can just look at each Nine other. Nine months yeah. hanging out together, you should know a little something about each other. Right? Exactly. I think they can just know what each other's they're thinking just based on like the, even like the slightest like face movements. Do you think some twins are to the point I where I kind of do like, that now with my sisters? <clears throat> oh, we yeah. look at each other and we obviously not twins. Really. But you better you grew up together for like yeah. for years. So you can pick up different pieces. You know, that little I mean, muscles have to be yeah. born together at the same time, type thing. Yeah, but there, there's some like chemical balance between two people that are, because they share the same DNA. To yeah. to the T. Well, I know twins that hate the shit out of each other too. So what's that explanation? <laughs> That's true. 
That's true. They probably, probably share everything, share everything their whole life. Yeah. I'll kill you and just be the only one. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine having a twin all your life, right? And then it's like, you know, you all have different shoes and stuff. And all of a sudden, your twin just takes your shoes. It's stuck. Because that's when hatred starts. Yeah. I, I would think that's a bonus. It's like two sets of clothing. You know what I mean? Like, my wardrobe is expanded. If you're financially sound, your parents are financially sound. Oh, if they are, yes, yeah. correct. Now I'll be sharing shoes and we both might have to figure out who's barefooted on the right side. <laughs> yeah, I, just, yeah. I need to go out. I need to do that shirt. Just, just, only one of us can go to Walmart. The other one has to stay. So, that's my good shirt. <laughs> yeah, I like that shoe. Oh my God, that's crazy. Yeah, I don't know if that went fine. I'd probably have to kill him. Yeah, yeah, I'm done. I don't want to yeah. It's like, um, what's the movie with um Batman? OG Batman. My, 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 oh, duplicity. Duplicity. My favorite line in that movie. Duplicity or multi Multiplicity. Yeah. Multiplicity. Then my favorite line in the movie was, of course, you have like the, the tougher version clone and then like the really, uh, like kind of like the sassier, more feminine clone. <laughs> and um, uh, he, so the, the, the tougher one is talking to the original Michael Keaton. And he's like, I'm going to slap you so hard, I'll kill the other guy. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't one of them sleeping with his wife? All of them were. All of them did. All of them did. All of them did. Because you cheated. But technically not. You it's know? Technically not. Oh, it's you. It's you. Yeah. It's you. It's not your twin. He even yeah. sleeps with the, like, the dumb one. The yeah. one, like, the, the, the clone of the clone of the clone. The dumb one probably was the one that put the work in. And, 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 and I think they joke about that. Too. What does that say about the wife? Like, all these same guys? Well, she doesn't know. Person. She doesn't know. She, thinks she, didn't, even she didn't even know they had yeah, she did. Yeah, that's right. He didn't know that. She, had no she, idea. she was getting all this attention and she was loving it. Yeah. yeah, but how many times was she laying on the bed and having this done? Like she must have been in overtime. It was him. No, it was it was a it was a night where they're like they're having like kind of makeup sex or whatever. <clears throat> and then he kept like Did he like high five yeah. the other guy or like come no. on in? No. I forget what happened. Yeah. <laughs> 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 like, there was a line I was like, yeah. Tag you. Michael, but it's all you. It's all you. So nah, you don't feel bad. Like it's, it's me. That's crazy. I did that movie and Mr. Mom. That's so. like a weird version of a train. <laughs> but it's all you. It's all you. It's all you. It's all I think I. I would still be kind of pissed though. Even but then it's, it's like, like if one of you put in more work, <laughs> then it's like. She you know it's something that no one wants. Yeah, she wouldn't know because then you came back in after you left, and that's the next one, the next one. You have plenty of time, like. You know, well, at least you do like get work done while that's happening. Yeah. But as long as she doesn't know. Yeah. That's the she, she, she didn't know. She, she had no idea. She, didn't know. she found at the end and she was like, oh my God, it's a problem. Yeah. Like, yeah. She's like, oh my God. The, you, before you she knew, she, she was said? like, oh, uh, you'd be taking Blue Chew. <laughs> <laughs> Blue Chew. Uh, this, 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 sponsored by Blue Chew. Blue Chew. Uh, <laughs> that's crazy, though. When you think, so here's the thing, right? If you know it's you, it's you. It's you. You, 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 it's you, 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 just, a just version. outside of you, yeah, right. No, but it's you, you having sex with your wife, and you're like, it's not sure, it's me, but now you're like, ah, I get to go do some work, and as you're doing that's work, and you hear, that's you the hear it, the, like, that's still, I mean, I would piss you off, down, no, that should piss trigger you off. something. Yeah. Why would that piss you off? Shouldn't it trigger something? It's you, it's like just hearing your wife, yeah. but you know, it's you. It's not like, like it's me. Well, the only yeah, way I can true. see it, but I remember, the, did you ever watch The Watchmen? Remember the big blue guy? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, he did that, but his brain is still intact with all the other clones. Exactly. That's the uh, only way I can. If your brain. If I was, if I was a big dick, Mister Manhattan naked around. Mister Manhattan him. naked. Yeah. 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 Do we see Dick? No, I think he just had that little. Yeah, the spandex. Yeah, like in the comic book. I'm him. Yeah. There is. There is. Like, yep. There's Dick. Yeah, we did. I think briefly, but yeah. I think you're right. It was I. As soon as you came out on the big screen, yeah. I yeah. was floating up there, falling out. <laughs> Imagine you're like, no, it wasn't blue. It was red. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be more memorable. <laughs> <laughs> Mister had the red. I was just shit. like, I'm gonna hover my big screen over too. Oh, he's on Mars, right? Or he's just hovering. Yeah. He sees butt crap. <laughs> What's funny to me is that is, what I understand the only thing I mean not the only thing but really crud up amazing actor I love him who plays Doctor Manhattan when he gets through that little accident he like becomes jacked because Billy really crud up isn't a jacked for I mean he's just like a normal size it's part of like being 
you know, superhuman turning into I guess that's true. Spider Man, you know, you, here's my abs all of a sudden. Yeah. I guess if you do if you have the ability to rearrange items, I wouldn't make myself jazz. Oh it's, it's, yeah. it's, uh, I'll be cut. <laughs> I'm up there with people on too. I'm gonna be fucking good. Yeah. Okay. Imagine you're like, oh, I just turned to a superhero. You know what? I'm gonna be fat. <laughs> I'll be the blob. <laughs> well, very strong and fat. So it rolls up the body wall. Strong and fat. And you can just fly. <laughs> 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 like a blob. Everything's <laughs> jiggling while you're yeah, yeah. soaring. It doesn't, it doesn't look like you're flying and like you're hovering. Right. <laughs> I, I think we just balloon? created a funny character. Right? <laughs> fat man. Yeah. Fat man. The just balloon. Just flying through the sky. And all the the fat, blimps. All the rolls. <laughs> the blimps. <laughs> That's what we call them, the blimp. blimp. That we just created a real hero. <laughs> and they don't even go fast either. No, no. every no. every Street. regular guy in the world <laughs> we do a six would respect them a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, that could be me. Oh, wait, is that a ranch tripping on me? Oh, ranch. <laughs> Gone his way to KFC. Or is it? Or is it? It's right. It's right. He doesn't even say the day. He just robs chicken wings. God damn. Is that his job? That's his job. What? He's saving the world. He's like, I gotta eat. Oh, no. oh, you get wings, you get wings. Yeah. <laughs> the wings really the like, bones. Like, it's um, the bones. The bones. The boomerang. The boomerang. He uh, he's like six hundred pounds. <laughs> yeah, I like him. I, I'm already both count with him. <laughs> oh, okay. So he's now, right now we're forehead. talking about like movies, all that. right. Um, there's one movie I want to show. We're gonna watch a movie. We're gonna uh, watch a movie. movie. We should put a movie right. on in the, like the background and just like to kind of like dissociate with it, and then frequently like like oh shit, that's wild, and then go back to the podcast. I do that. My wife hates it. <laughs> yeah. We so watch this it, and I got a comment. She just look at me and go, Can "So not talk." And I'm like, "But you know, this is what we do." So I got to talk. <laughs> Here's a trailer I want to put on. Oh. And we all know this person. Man, I've never had the honor of meeting him. Actually, I know well about him though. Oh. This person is David Okino. Ah, the legend. Uh, the myth, the legend. He wrote this wonderful movie, hey. or as you Sinko. like to call him, Dave um, Ocho Cinco. I, I figured, I knew he called him that. No, I never no, called him no. Ocho Cinco. So you guys oh. know Tasha from? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, Parker, right? yeah. No, 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 Tasha from Mars. Oh, oh yes, yeah, 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 yeah. She said, "Who's this guy? Uh, Dave Ocho Cinco." <laughs> I could not stop laughing. Really? I was like, "What just?" It's spelled similar. It's spelled similar. Like that. What's his name again? Dave Ocho Cinco. I was like, close. <laughs> He's like, yes, you're yeah, absolutely is, right. That I, is his name. I said, I'm gonna save his name as Dave Ocho Cinco now. Yeah. Like, I just. I, but I'm surprised that, you, that uh, you've never ever referred to him as that before. I didn't. No, I didn't. I, didn't. When, I didn't. probably said it in my head, but never really said. Whenever it. I see oh. Okino like spelled out, I immediately people know, normally Ocho people say Ochino. Ochino. I heard Ochino. I heard Ochino. Yeah, but just like is that a racist? Yeah. Then, I, oh yeah, there's a Spanish man. I'm like, oh, they say Ochino. Oh, I'm like, eh. What, what does that mean? Ochino. Oh, Chinese. Oh, yeah. Well, Ochino. And I'm like, I mean, yeah, yeah. No, listen. no, not everybody. Dude, they call Koreans Chinese. You know, I, you know, I it's just Dominicans never... be wild out. It's not even Dominicans, Puerto Ricans too. Yeah, we I just mean, normally call everybody like, up. I mean, well, I'll just, you know, not me, but like, you know, my wife, family, and everything, if they want Chinese food, oh, let's go get Chinos. We'll eat Chinos today. <laughs> they call Chin- Thai food is Chino, too. Yeah. 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 <laughs> the lead singer from Death Town is Chino Moreno. Spicy basil Chinos. No, it's spicy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I don't <laughs> fuck up some Chinese food right now. Here's the, uh, the trailer. I could, I could get this Yeah. Right. Ricky Stanicki, uh, which is going to be on Prime Video on March 7th. The cast is unreal. They got that redhead guy. When did he do this? Well, we yeah, just came out like a week ago. Yeah. What um, were we doing? What do you mean? When did he uh, have time for this? Oh, we were doing. He sold this. They, he sold it. they bought Shit. it from him. Oh, he did this. Oh, this is okay. yeah, yeah. This is a while back. It was originally for this cast. It was, I think, it was, it was Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey as Ricky Jim Kevin Jim. Hart. Wow. Was tied to the project. I guess Jim Carrey dropped off. 
And then I think um, <laughs> <Howard> <laughs> <laughs> Kevin dropped out after that. Oh, you dropped. But uh, here we go. Same with Slug. Oh, yeah. Hey, Nikki, what up, man? Are you serious? Have someone call me when you get out of surgery, all right? You should drive out there. Ricky's been there for you. Yeah, no, 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 no. The devil's in the details, my friend. That can work. Atlantic City, here we come. What we got? Ricky's cancer's back. Why does it have to be cancer? Won't everybody get worried? Yeah. And that's going to take us right into the World Series. Turn it on my money in a couple nights. Ricky's the Ricky. The best friend we never had. Mm. Our baby's going to be born six weeks early. I was born six weeks early. <laughs> I want to know where the hell you guys were tonight. We called every hospital and there was no record of a Ricky Stanicki. You know, all we did was tell one lie hundreds and hundreds of times over many, many years. If the truth does come out, my marriage is over. What if we hire an actor to play Stanicki? Rock hard rock. X rated rock and roll impersonator. I do a whole act. All the wall top to bottom jizz jams. Thanks for coming out, Star Ladies and gentlemen. gentlemen. So happy to be here. This is a really bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. I think cold turkey and the blues, Ricky Snicky's in the program, remember? Oh, Rod. It's, no, what you think it is? It's just piss. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not, I want you to admit that Ricky Snicky does not exist. Hey, much more. Ah! Yes. Yes. This is Ted Summerhays, my boss. Ted, nice to meet you. Digging the suit and the seedlings, man. The seedlings. The hair plugs are good, right? This is my hair. Little is her job. So. <laughs> Epic night, am I right, guys? I was really taken with your friend Stanicki. He's got brass balls on him, that guy. That's why I hired him. That's awesome. You just said... What did you say? Just say it one more time? We can't win the night of our sight. Not only did I miss the birth of my son, but I let some poor little Peter Franklin impersonator snip his... And we're done. <laughs> 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 Unbelievable. Show's over, Rod. It's Ricky. Ricky Stanicki isn't real! My job sucked at it. Oh, my God. Oh, my are you a fraud, sir? Unless you're talking about it. We gotta get rid of him. Every time he tries to make a point, it's like he's smoking invisible dogs. Jerk, God, it's true. Now it looks like I'm cupping the balls. <laughs> Dude, that's gonna be Dude, funny. that is. That the only problem is, is you know the plot of the movie almost immediately, though. That's the only problem with the trailer. I mean, but it's but a comedy you, movie. Yeah. There's also little, there's always yeah. little things that you're never going to yeah. see within the trailer, but I mean, the yeah. cast is great. William H. Macy? Big fan of John Cena. John Cena yeah. is an amazing comedic actor. Yeah. He's, have you seen Peacemaker? No. Yes. He's like, so yeah. good in that. He plays yeah. the biggest asshole ever. It's amazing. Suicide Squad, I was like, that was the best character no, in the yeah, movie. Yeah. Cop blocker. Clock, 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 it's like an extra, you pay like extra nine bucks a month and you have health insurance. Wow. It's just nine bucks a month. And then if you do like another, I don't know, like premium things or whatever, then you get like, if you have like medication or whatever, then maybe like an extra five bucks and maybe like, you know, 14 bucks a month. Motherfucker Jeff Bezos out here taking over the world then. Right? And then people were saying like, you know, 10 years ago, why doesn't like a billionaire like, you know, provide health insurance? And like, there you go. <laughs> so. To be a fucking healthcare provider. Yeah. So, I mean, I mean, he's genius. He's making more money out of it. And I mean, his wife took out half of that shit. So now, yeah, so you're right that he's trying to get the other half and then double it. Yeah. Isn't she also dating like a, uh, like a middle school teacher or something like that? Good for her. Right? Imagine just being like a middle school teacher and making like 50 oh. bucks, $50,000. What you doing, man? Get in it. I know. I know. Get in it. I got, I got, I got, I got to look pretty enough you know i really got i really want to be a stop uh, running stop running stop no running makes me pretty yeah. stop running please she leave my that's sick. what she doesn't want sick she doesn't want a runner yeah get a gut get a beer yeah. get a beer yeah. right? I, I was working for a beer guy good like a good two years ago and it fucking came out Look, but like, this thing. it doesn't right yeah but it's, you're proportional it's like 12 years right yeah, yeah no, no when i when i gain weight it, it goes everywhere right. i'm gonna tell you something right now first time i met you no 
Not the first time. I think the second time we had Passaic? an interaction. Where were you? Uh, Passaic High School. And uh, we were on a tech scout. And Rob's there taking notes. And Terrell pulls me to the side. And he's like, you see Rob over there? I was like, yeah. I was like, well, what's up? He's like, he's shaped like a pear. <laughs> I was like, whoa. Says so Terrell. I was going to say, Terrell. Well, it's like, you ever touch the raw arms? They're huge. Yeah. Yeah. You ever but see your more? finger goes in. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a sponge. Uh, you ever see Terrell walk? He howls. Oh, I know. He howls. Waddles. Waddles. He waddles. No. He, uh, he, does, he waddles. Waddles. Yes. <laughs> like, like, he's a big like, 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 if you didn't know him, he is pretty menacing looking. But the. Yeah, he's, um, a, he's a big yeah, teddy bear. Do right. yeah, yeah. you, you play sports? sports? I don't. Yeah, know. yeah. It's called fantasy play? football. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Drag race. Yeah. Yeah. Drag race. <laughs> <laughs> <Sports. laughs> you know? This is called the uh, the duck walks. That's, that takes a lot of athletic talent. Oh, you call it the duck walk, right? Yeah. I don't, well, is it, it a duck walk? It's a lot. No, well, like well a duck duck walk. Walk. no, and I'm talking about a duck walk, like like a dance. Have you seen that shit? No, no. Yeah, I have seen him do it before. I want, I want video proof. No, but it's when it's when you it's like you're crouched down and you like. It's fucking hard. It takes a lot of athletic. He, he's done it. No. Oh. Yes. Oh, yeah. yes. 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 You've seen him do that. Sure. You've seen him bend down. I think so. I see. Oh, I've seen him bend you down. You showed him. I showed him. Show him. Yeah. 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 Wow. He was out working. This? No. No way. No. They, it's faster <laughs> than that. It's faster than that. It's faster than that. No way you can wow. do It's faster than that. Step forward with the other leg. It should be a very run. No, no. You got to It's a run. It's a run. That looks like a walk that you're trying to escape because you're like over some girl's house and her husband's coming home. And you're I trying to like <laughs> <I> <laughs> get, 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 get away the <laughs> underneath the bushes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no, it no. It's, it's, it's like dragging. an actual too. like uh, exercise? It's like, yeah, it's like a warm yeah. up for the mobility. My whatever. knees just swelled up looking at Yeah, my knees, knees won't be able to do that. No, it's it's a dance. It's almost like the what's it the Russian dance do when they do like. Are you so terrible? Oh, the, the thing dance. where they go like this, kind of. But it's it's it's. You need to document this. When did you see I'm this? It's a, dra- it's a drag queen dance. I'm, I'm saying that. Right. And we, just called her, drag. we just called him a drag queen dancer. Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, we were talking about how many sports he's done, and I said, and you, you said fantasy, and also I said drag race. Mm. And that's a sport. And so I've seen him done a duck walk. Oh. I've never seen a duck walk. Except for that. You, that's you, not you, how I did that, and I felt compelled to grab this for some reason. I'll do that, and now I'm done. <laughs> Wait, my mind's all over the place. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, I've seen, I've seen yeah. Trout work the corner. You know, yeah, yeah. yeah. Kind of duck walk. Like, sure. is he a left leg or right leg? <laughs> well, pull up. Shaved or not shaved? I don't know. Do you think he's hair? Oh, I think he has hair. He has a nice beard. He has a beard. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I like his impressive beard and. I, I respect the fact that he oils it up and does his thing. He d- he does care a lot about his hygienics. Yeah, unless it's five a.m. Then he just coming in and it's like it's like a bird's nest. <laughs> no idea. I'm pretty I'm pretty disgruntled right now actually. Yeah, yeah I got shape. I'm Whatever. trying to grow mine. I want to do what you do. Before. Yeah. Have Have you had it long like that before? I've never had it that long. It gets to the point where when my beard gets to like around right here. Mm-hmm. I don't like the the. It does feel it bad. It starts to feel itchy. But yeah. that, that's by the whole kit. When I say kit, you get brush, all that stuff. The oils, the oils will make it not itchy because now you get it in there, you work it in, and it gets it to your skin. It's like a lotion, mm. but you can't put lotion on your beard. Yeah. You put oil. like I got like a sandwich and all that. So when you put that in there, it stops the itchiness. You don't feel itchy anymore. Because your skin's not dry, it's all oiled up. So you get a little shine, it smells good, oh. it's less tangled. You get the whole kit. There's a shampoo, there's a conditioner. It's a process. Every morning, this is me. Shampoo. You shampoo your beard? Every day. Really? Every day. I don't think I've ever shampooed. I just kind of like, I've, I've shampooed my hair and let it kind of go there. I'm no. not like, see? Of it. No. And there's a whole process for me every morning. You said you never really lotioned anyway. My body wash. I do body wash every day. Yeah, but you don't put lotion on your skin. No, I got this Dove. For, <laughs> I recently got this Dove for men, the cream face mm-hmm. hand cream. 
Um, and I fucking love it. I love the way it smells, really. That's kind of why I like it. But uh, I was breaking out because I had really stressful past few weeks, and they're just red everywhere. I never break out like that ever. It almost looked like I was like a heroin addict. It could be the uh, the lotion. Or the heroin. Uh, no, I got the lotion because of the <laughs> because of the heroin breakouts. I was scratching <laughs> scratching my scabs. We're gonna edit this in a way where it really looks like you're a heroin user. I'm <laughs> telling you, my goal is to, is to be eighty five pounds by tomorrow. By <laughs> I, I wanna be a beautiful starlet. Uh, I'm trying to get my close up. Yeah. Wait, so going back to this, you you <laughs> you wash your beard, yeah, brush it. Go into the shower, do your yeah. thing, start from the top, like we all do, right? Yep, yep. Is exactly. anything, do whatever you do up here. I'm gonna cut you off. So Will's eyes were just like, wait. I, mean, I, I start I, from the top. I'm, 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 I'm glad you caught it. Yeah. I, 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 yeah, toes up. Toes up. <laughs> I, 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 I want I, I my follicles. I will work my ladder up all the way up to I want my hair, hair going up. It was like a shower, <laughs> like I'm in the bedroom. My toes are up. <laughs> <laughs> Same shit for using my head. I'm using my toes. Hey, you gotta keep your toes up. You, you never know. You gotta move my knuckle hairs. <laughs> yeah, I want I want the hair on my legs going upwards. I want it to defy gravity. This is just like the blend. <laughs> so there's oil. Yeah. <clears throat> so you do your thing up top, right? Sure. Now we will fucking as we all do, as us humans do. You know, belly hair, <laughs> fucking top of hair, same shit. Yeah. Shampoo, work your way down, and you get your beard and stuff. So this is do you use a separate shampoo for your beard? Yes, sir. What? what why? Why? It's just hair. It's just no, hair. It's, not, it's the see, same thing. It's not the same thing. What are you talking it's about? It's not the same it's, thing. It's, de- it's dead follicles. No, it's, it's, it's not. Touch your beard man. and touch your hair. You oh, just yeah. feel like it's a different Dude, uh, This shit is right here. It's like pubic hair. Let's just admit that. This is like pubic hair. Yeah, yeah. but you have thick hair on your head, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But look, it's this shit is curly, soft. Yeah, right? It looks right? softer. Yeah. You know, it's like, did you get a haircut not... recently? It looks cool. Yeah, I did. I, I only, only got really enough time good. yesterday in my fucking giant gap between cold times. <laughs> yeah. So oh. I was like, oh, you know what? Let me get a fucking haircut and be up for the next 20 hours. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what I did. It was productive uh, Friday morning. Yeah. That's yeah. the best when you, when you have the Friday day where it's like in between... Thursday and Friday, where they give you enough time. At There's least. no fucking Friday. Friday that's good. That's no, no, I I know about. <laughs> oh, you're meaning from Thursday's from wrap Thursday. to Friday's call time? Right, right, right. So it's it's not like a, it's not like a, a sneaky first Thursday. Oh, to it Friday depends Friday. if it doesn't do a domino effect where your that's wrap time on a Thursday is like four a.m. and then your call time. Well, that's what Friday I'm saying. That's the like worst. Six a.m. No, it, 6 p.m. It was, it was, it was 7 a.m. call, 7 30 a.m. call on Friday. We were done by, you know, 7 ish. And then it was like 4 30 call the next day. Oh. Whoa. Yeah. I've so, been through that. And it's like, fuck. <clears throat> and then now here's Monday. Now it's like, hey, see you 7 30. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fuck a weekend. We used to do right, that with right. Marvel. Super Bowl weekend. Super Bowl weekend, too. Yeah. We used to do that with Marvel because Marvel, a lot of the Marvel jobs were night. So we used right. to do pure night shifts. So you'll have those weeks where it's like, oh, right, here's a couple of day scenes or stage days. Yeah. And then it's like, okay, great. And then all of a sudden, Wednesday, it's like 8 a.m. call time. And then on Thursday, it's like 6 p.m. call time. Yeah. You know? See? Yeah. Jeez, that's that's not even healthy. No, I'm just like, no. What the fuck are you doing? I remember, I remember rapping on set, coming home, getting home around seven a.m. Don't go to sleep because this is the only time now, and which I kind of like. I get to take my kids to school, and then I would drop them off at school for eight, come back home, go to sleep, mm-hmm. and then you able to go back to sleep because remember, all night I was working. But here's 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 the messed up part. Was you put your head on your pillow at 8 a.m. after I drop the kids off, come put my head hits the pillow. I'm getting a call right. from the art department who they all weren't on set right. because they, they work normal they start hours. 8 a.m. Yeah. You know, and like now I got to deal with these phone calls. And my manager at that time was like, "Don't pick up the calls." And I'm like, "My downfall is I care." Yeah, you know, well, it's like, like if you don't care, then you look like shit. Right, right, right. You go, oh, this motherfucker doesn't answer. Exactly. Yeah. He's bad. And then when the word, word gets up to the wrong people. To the wrong people. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, like, we couldn't do this because we were waiting on this guy to give right. us the okay. Yeah. And he didn't pick up. And then, and then of course, your manager is like, why aren't you picking the phone call? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Because when the manager just gets with the, the questions and they don't know because yeah. 
I mean, they're you know knee deep into the next episode. Right. And they're like, well, I don't know. All, all things it. that we should be discussing when we uh, you know have our meetings, but yeah. <laughs> right, right. No one goes to these meetings. <laughs> <clears throat> But the uh, it's, it's on a Saturday at 10 a.m. I know, motherfuckers. Yeah. I just got home. <laughs> yeah. oh, fuck, I'm gonna be zooming in. Can't do it. Can't do it. Uh, that's me. Just... So we're all locations, mm-hmm. right? How long have you been in the industry for? Um, relatively new, man. Uh, this is probably going on my six. I want to say I started 2017. Whatever. Oh, so you you started when? 2019. 19. Yeah. Whatever Rami season one was, that's when yeah. that was my first game. No, I was the end of 2018, sorry. 20, end of 2018. And you're an ALM. Now. Now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I finally got my full Respectful. bone of the like, Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, opportunity. I done onset, like, you know, just uh, day playing on a couple things. Well, not day playing, like, bumped up from an assistant to be the onset guy. Yeah. And because that ALM has something to do. I don't so, know, baseball game, I don't know, whatever. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So, so important. being in this industry <clears throat> and being in locations, and I'll, for both of you, right? Now, from being behind the scenes in pre production, in production, in meetings, and preps, and shooting, and rap, if you were given a chance to not do locations, but to do any other position within mm. this industry, and X out producing, right? Mm-hmm. Just nitty gritty. Hmm. What? What uh, would you take? I, we have to bring some else. Yeah. We have to bring some else. Yeah. I I think. Go. Oh, I think I'll scenic. See. Scenic. Yeah. Paint all day sounds awesome. Although the only problem is you're not. It's not like everyday thing. What about stunts? Got these stunts. See, that's what I was doing. Oh, yeah. That's sick. Stunts. Well, a lot, a lot of, I imagine a lot of overnight suits, a lot of the stunts and fight scenes you have in it. That's fine. Yeah, I was fine with that. They're spending, yeah, but I mean, remember the downfall of doing stunts. Well, at least you're putting your body on the line. Yeah, yeah. But at least you're fit and you could always train. You know? Stunts and, yeah, stunts are sack. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah stunts are sack. Yeah. Yeah. And you're badass too. Everyone, whenever there's some people got like on set, like there's like the like, fucking men. Mm-hmm. They're like the badass people. Oh no, man! I mess with some women. I know, I, but I even oh, met oh, women included. Like they're the man too. Oh yeah, the man. Like, okay, sure, you yeah, know, they're, they're yeah, fucking yeah. awesome. Yeah, yeah. Got it. So, man, I, I, so I was doing that uh, second unit work on uh, Madam Web. You were on Madam Web. I was second unit work. This up in the Bronx with nice. the ambulance chase. Yeah, yeah. That woman that was driving that ambulance. Man, I was like. She was like <clears throat> just cutting these corners, going yeah. for it. I was like, Damn, look at that bus move. <laughs> it's like I want. She if was, I had to go to the hospital and I was dying. I want her to drive me. <laughs> I want her to get me. There. Was she stunting like a, like an ambulance? Or yeah, like, dude. Damn. Damn, man. She was just Wait, like. Wasn't like someone uh, on the top of it? That movie's gonna suck. No, no, no. Way. Oh, madam, what? Why would you say? I, the, the trailer doesn't look that. Cool. It didn't look that good, but it's Sydney Swift. Sweeney. I can't. Yeah, you know, I was looking at the trailer. It doesn't even look like a movie. It looks like a TV. I thought it was a TV show. Yeah, like the the production value of it looks it. like a TV. Is show. it really attached to that no. whole Spider Verse thing? No. Well, it's attached to the Spider Verse. I mean, in a way where it's like dimensional thing, okay. but it's not a part of Tom Holland. No, uh, that's what I, no, it's not I think it is. No, no, I don't think it is. you sure? I thought it was the whole Morbius and. I think it's part Venom. of more. I think it's part of the Morbius and Venom thing. Then, so then that, so that's, that's, okay, that's separate. Because then that 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 trailer looks like it meshes with the Morbius Venom. Yeah, it's not a part. Type of so, look. So it's not a part of Tom Holland. Tom is gone. He has nothing to do with Venom. No, it's Morbius. a different universe. It's a different dimension. But Sony would never want to incorporate that altogether. Like that would make no sense to me if well, I own the rights to Tom Holland making a movie. I would love to. Well, I thought Venom was. Together. Venom was not. No, but remember, it, there was a teaser. Um, there's a. But that was a Marvel teaser. Yeah. Remember, Which Sony still has their hand in that. They, 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 they yeah. made a deal. Yeah. They struck a deal, but they could yeah. do like five movies with uh, Spider Man. Yeah, but they like cut at the end of one of them. It was. On it, so it was right. the end of Venom, two, where he's in a resort and he yeah. like, like the the windows blow up or something. And he's uh-huh. transported, and he looks at the TV and it's Tom Holland. 
Yeah. As, and oh, so yeah. he's like, who's yeah. that? So what happened was the, um, uh, it was a teaser into this Doctor Strange one when he, okay. he like, he says, I wish everyone forgot about Spider-Man. So all the different spider yeah. yeah. So that Tom, that Tom Hardy, Venom, was transported into the universe. The how of uh, the reason why is because the Venom symbiote knows like all secrets of the world, so that's why he was transported. Mm-hmm. And then he and then at the end of the movie when he says everyone back home, Tom Holland Spider Man when he says everyone back home, Tom Hardy, God, this is, I can't believe yeah, this. It's, Tom it's Hardy like goes back to his universe. <laughs> so what I'm trying to there. say is How'd that you back because then they said he was stranded, right? Then stranded. Then he was like he was not picked up. And he. Was, it was just there. It wasn't even like he, some he was, Caribbean he, yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. He was in the so, R. So that's why <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. he was in the R. He was in the R. <laughs> and so that's yeah, so at the end of that that Doctor Strange movie where the, the the multiverse or whatever, at the end of it, it cuts to Tom Tom Hardy at the bar, and he's like, "Yeah," and then this and this and this, and then he vanishes because the wish happened or whatever. Really? Yeah. Um, oh, so so that that that's what I'm trying to say is that Tom. That's the reason why the Venom. Character is not in the Tom Holland MCU version. Yeah, Sony. So in other words, Sony's completely fucking this up. Yeah, it's okay. a mess. There it's a go. mess. Yeah, it's it's really weird, and you know, they, no they're way. trying they're trying something, and it it was kind of successful with that when Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield and Tom Holland were all together. I, I, I liked it. It was cool. I, I liked it. That it was that was a really good. It was a good. Movie. Yeah, um, it kind of made you feel a little bit like. I wish they would have went a little bit more with um, Andrew Byron. Garfield. Yeah, he was great. He was Garfield so excited to be there. Garfield was great. I, I feel yeah. like he's Garfield, a great Peter Parker from the beginning too. He yeah. played the best Peter Parker for sure. Because Andrew? yeah, yeah, because Spider Man was always a dickhead teenager. Yeah, he played that like, well. Always talking shit. Talking shit. Yes. You know, now he got the powers. Now he can do this. And yeah. he's more like... He was cocky. He was very yeah, cocky. Yeah, it yeah. was that, that one fight that he got into the guys in the parking lot. And he was like, oh, you want more? And like, shoot. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Beating him. That, that was like, comic book yeah. Spider-Man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, and he was like, yeah. yeah. them to so the yeah. point where it's like, oh, you really you know, like... I'm, I feel bad for these guys. He's like, he's like, I got to sneeze. Switch does that. No, but I mean, um, it's weird because also with, with with when that happened and Sony's trying to do their own thing, when you watch a Sony movie now that has to do with Spider Man, it doesn't seem like it matters because what matters is now the MCU. Yeah, you have to watch for sure. So it's, I mean, I mean, honestly though, like the Venom movies are good. They're 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 entertaining. Oh. No, they're entertaining. The first they're not, one. The first that one. Second one. Second one was shitty. That was, second one was shitty. absolute yeah. Yeah. garbage. And Morbius was. God, oh, absolute garbage. Awful. I fell asleep. I tried to watch Carnage twice. I fell asleep twice. Yeah. 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 And I don't know, so like, a weekday good. thing, like, you know, after work thing. Like, it was yeah. like, oh, it's Saturday. Got full of energy. Yeah. So, I was just like, well, gone. Next gone. year, they're coming out with uh, Craven. That looks brutal, too. It, it, I just don't understand what they're doing. I don't know. I don't, they're trying to make this world, but it's the it, Spider it's, Universe. The Spider where, Universe where world. Like, without Spider Man. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> right, like, right. There's all these antagonists, but Spider Man is not a part of it. What they should do is just put Andrew Garfield in this world. Just plop him right yeah. in. Bring him back. You know? Like maybe he could be. Well, I think. I mean, how old is Andrew Garfield? Now? I mean, he looks young. He looks great. And, and yeah, he could be an older yeah, Spider Man. That's what I was going to say. He should be an older Spider Man. Because there are comic books where there's older people. He's 40 years old. Look at the Spider Man. 40 years old. Yeah. They you had the older ones, you had the younger ones, you had all these different versions. Yeah. It doesn't matter. You could, he could just, you're a forty year old. He uh, could be a veteran uh, Spider Man. He's he's been around yeah. the block once twice. I mean, he has like a broken Speaking leg. Three kids. Who knows? Yeah. They should do that with Batman. Well, they tried to do it with Ben Affleck. Yeah, but it's like they should. You remember Batman Beyond? Yeah, absolutely. Oh yeah, yes, yes. That so I love the that, cartoon, man. Love that it. was great. They should bring Batman Beyond and have Michael Keaton as the old Batman and have some new guy. Yes, as the kid. Yeah. as that. I, I mean, definitely wasn't mad at the Robert Patterson thing, even though it was, it was really good, though. I I, at first, it was, you know, Twilight and this stuff, because I never really watched that stuff, and I was just like, what, what did I see him in? I don't even know what I saw him in besides that. Oh, um, Good Times. Damn, when I saw him on, on Batman, I was just like, yo, this kid got me. Well, it, it got kid. me to... He's like, you know, 30 also, but... <laughs> you know what threw my mind frame kid. out that with <laughs> casting? When Heath Ledger was supposed to be the Joker, and everybody shitted on yes. it. 
Yes. Like, well, he's going to be horrible. Oh, you're talking about this guy from yeah. the Julius Stile movie? Yeah, pr- like, the, the Prince Knight, whatever the hell yeah, that yeah. was. That was a good movie, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Sure, sure, sure. Uh, agree right. disagree. Uh, but um, I watched it. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I, I feel like, you know, it sucks for his situation because it's like he did such a good role as the Joker to yeah, where he, he passed away to where he, you'll never, ever know the outcome of the way how much everyone oh, loved sure. it. Oh, yeah. 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 Also, as well, that was really pissed me off. I remember when Jared Leto was trying to become the Joker and he was trying to like outdo Heath Ledger's like, operation for it. He was like, yeah. And, and you know, there's been, like interviews with like Will Smith and Margot Robbie. And, and yeah, Jared went crazy. He sent us a box of, of a he dead possum shit yeah. to right. someone. And they're, like, or kind of, he sent a box of you. He, he was, and it's like, you know, he wow, was, what a happened. Joker thing to do. Like, yeah. yeah. It's, that's, that's my thought. It's, that's, yeah. Oh, um, <laughs> man. It was um, an actor. Look at me. Well, yeah. I'm gonna go home and talk to my kids this way. So I... <laughs> <laughs> Why you talk to them like that every day? <laughs> it's like, all right. And then also in 30 Seconds to Mars or whatever, it's fucking bad. He's uh, got good songs, but man, he is such a tool. I'm not listening to any of his stuff. Uh, he, like he got some pipes on him. It's like he's going, you know what, as a Nick fan, yeah. oh, you know what, I want to go listen to Charles Dillon and his fucking band. No, I don't. <laughs> no, I fucking don't. <laughs> Want you to worry about the fucking Knicks, right? And I'll figure that shit out. I don't need you to do, worry about <laughs> acting. I don't you're need to hear about your fucking band. Yeah. Yeah. But here's what we're, we're listen. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna end that conversation because wait, every year they want to fuck a f- few right. couple of games. All of a sudden, you the Knicks are gonna blah blah blah, no. and then all of a sudden downhill. Don't want to end it. No, I don't want to end it now because it's different this year. And the reason why it's different is my man Leon. Do you think he's going to take it all the way? My man, Leon is actually making the right moves. No first round picks. We're giving up. Picked up all these guys. Yeah. Built up, uh, I mean, our bench is ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah. Once we get Randall back and OG back. Who are um, Knicks acquired Bojan and yeah, Alex yeah. Burks from? For me. Seats. For me. I got traded in that. It was me for the two of them. It's me. Oh, it's salary dump. That's <laughs> that's what <It's>, happened. <laughs> I think it's familiar. <laughs> I saw a video on there. So like, I do what I'm not like, if, the Knicks, <laughs> if the Knicks win the finals, the NBA championship, New York right, see, will see, end. You just said, yeah. The stop talking? No, see, I just wanted to talk up to that point. Now you're talking about finals and winning. It's just. like, but if. But the, no, I'm talking about this video. That if that happens, you know the mayhem that's gonna happen. You're taking this to the streets. <laughs> that's right here. We're gonna be out there in the streets, running for our lives, <laughs> or or being part of the problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I found the other day in my uh, in my closet? A Patrick Ewing jersey. Good. Wait, found? You you forgot that you had, I had it? God, I had it. it. You know what? It was tucked away in a bin. Damn. I forgot I have jerseys sometimes. And the only reason okay. why I looked in that bin because I was looking for a winter jacket. <laughs> and see, it was in that bin. And I completely, completely understand that because for like three years, I did not watch any Nick games. Right, right. I refused to it's put so on MSG. Trash. I was yeah. like, fuck this. Yeah. You guys don't care? I don't care. Yeah. And then he started caring. And I cared. Yeah. I stopped. I you didn't know, care. My last yeah. good time... I've ever like was a Nick fan. It was early two thousands, two thousand two, two thousand three. I remember making myself a nice big N- NBA fine uh, uh, playoffs, making myself a nice sandwich before the game start. I'm in the kitchen making like fully depth out oh, sandwich. What's your NBA final sandwich look like? Co- yeah. I I mean it was just <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. the um, it was different types of cold cuts, spicy um, mustard. <laughs> mustard. Oh, it man. was it was just salami, bologna, turkey, buffalo chicken. It was just the whole night. You know that Calvin dabbles in Italian. 
<laughs> we were actually just talking about this. Yeah, yeah. Like, how, like, how, that's, how is it just that's the second job. How, how is like, no, like, I'll, be, I'll make Italian subs. <laughs> yeah. No, but it was oh, b- before that. <laughs> Can't talk about meat in front of guys. It's too long. Yeah. 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 Foot long sandwich. This is what I do. <laughs> I was gonna pause that video, screenshot it, and all of a sudden a dick's in it. <laughs> yeah. We all got one of our problems. It was Latrell Sprewell. Ah, Marcus Camby. H.C. Allen Houston. Like that was like the last time because we were not that, supposed like, to be there. No, but those guys did their. Thing. We were not supposed to be there. It was Those always fun. Get we had we know that. damn well we was not gonna win that finals, but we were like, oh shit! Still though, we were here. Like, oh shit! My other one was obviously Knicks Houston, and then OJ fucked that up for us. So thank you, OJ. <laughs> <laughs> you don't remember that? Was that during the finals? Are we oh, probably not old enough, right? Um, yeah. Was that ninety nine? I was, was, I was four. No, no, no. That was 94. 94. I was just born. I think it was 94. You are born in 94? Yeah, 94. Yeah, that was, like, right? That's when OJ ran around in, yeah, the Bronco. in his Bronco. Yeah. It was 90 something. We sent it home. Here's the finals. And all of a sudden, it cut off. And it right. Or you said this Bronco. So what the fuck happened? He just, like, changed the channels. And it's just the Bronco. Just the Bronco. So here we are. <laughs> we all watching OJ fucking running from the law. It's like, yeah, but the fucking finals is going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Who, what is this? Who cares? Yeah. Why Why should that even, like, that, that'd be like, that'd be like cutting off to, like, I mean, yeah, the World Series or something. Or like, just, yeah. It would never happen now. No, no, no. Never. No, no. The news channel decided that that was more important than the finals. The fucking finals. Yeah. Blasphemy. That, oh, oh blasphemy. since we're talking about the yes. finals, what NBA team has never won a championship? Teams. 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 I'm going to go with uh, Oklahoma. That oh, was Vancouver. Uh, I'll name the number. It's 10 of them. 10? 10. 10. Did 10. I pick one right? Pelicans? Uh, who'd you say? Pelicans. I mean, we were. Pelicans? Vancouver, that was. Okay. No, not Vancouver. See, Adel, I don't think ever won one that turned into Oklahoma, right? No, what are Oklahoma now? Oklahoma mm-hmm. was Seattle before. No, Super Oklahoma, what? Uh, oh, s- no. Not the Nets. Wait, hold on. Wait, time out. The Suns? Yeah, Phoenix, Phoenix never, won never won one. No, they lost to uh, Jordan. Juggernaut. Yeah, where Charles Barkley was there with Danny Marley and. Uh, Speaking of Kevin Charles Johnson. Barkley, yeah. amazing person. Charles Barkley? Oh, amazing. I think he's funny, he's candid, and he speaks to I just, and I just did a he's job. He's funny as fuck. I just did a Letterman job, and Charles oh, Barkley walks by, and it's like. How big is this guy? You know what? It's probably like shrinking now he's older. I didn't have to really look up at him, but he walked by me and he could see that I was like, it's Charles Barkley. Yeah. Charles Barkley. And he was like, hey, how you doing? You know, and that's it. Kept him moving. Yeah. Which is nice. Yeah. yeah. It was, it's just, it's, you know, what I mean, like, yeah. But I think athletes compared to movie stars are totally different. Yeah. Yeah. They're more humble. Yeah. Well, Athletes are more humble. They know humble. why they're less dramatic. Exactly. Because, exactly. Uh, because they have proof of themselves we're, to be there. Yeah. You know? We're fans. And yeah. It's like, yeah. yeah dude, what you're doing out there is amazing. Yeah. As far as Barkley, man, he's like probably one of the greatest power forwards we've ever seen that they're mm-hmm. on the tip. But he was afraid. Yeah. He wasn't one no. of these guys that would slap you right in your face. Right. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, okay, I'll run down the list, but the next one is the Jazz. I was going to say the Jazz, but I was... Which I guess the Wolves um, shot them down. Yeah, 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 well, yeah, rightfully chance. so. I don't think that Carl Malone... The mailman. Molester. The mailman. Carl Malone, the molester. <laughs> the child molester. Oh, right. Yeah. yeah. Nah, dude, you, could be, you can't be out there doing things 15. 15? What you think she's 15 or 16, but like, said she was like 18 or something like that. Uh, no, come on, man. We, we're not there. He didn't meet her at a club. Right. Where he was 21 <laughs> years old and older. He, he met her where he met her. He's like, hey, I'm uh, 20. And he's like, cool, we're good. No, you got to verify this shit. You got to see that ID. But then they can also have a fake ID. I was just I was just talking about my fake neighbors. You, you ask, ask for ID? No, you don't. No, I'm, I'm, I'm saying in a, in a, okay. in a situation. In a, at a venue, when you go inside, and it's, you assume that it's 21 right. and over. Yeah. Why would you not assume that everyone in there is 21 and over? What well, I mean fake IDs? 
No, I was talking to my neighbors last night. They, 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 went, they went to high school. They would go to clubs when they were like 17 with fake IDs. No, dude, but you had the, they have the, the, the card readers that swipe in. But this was depending on where you're going. Though. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. But then you know, you shouldn't be held liable to a certain point. And then, it, and, then it, and then it gets around what club isn't doing that, which, which club isn't scanning. And so that gets around and then they go to this, which is a club. Okay. I, 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 I'm not defending. Uh, no, 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 I'm not, therefore, I'm definitely not defending that. It's just, it gets into a tricky situation. As a 44-year-old man, I'll stay away from anybody that looks like <laughs> under 30. It's like, and I'm married anyway, so it doesn't, I'll stay away anyway. But yeah. if I was like to do something, I'd be like. Well, how old was, was Carl Malone at that time? As 44. <laughs> no, shit. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'll stop my argument. <laughs> 44. No, no, no. It's like, yeah, it was my 44 year old man's at a club. Oh, like, Car- Car- I think Carmelo was just a dirtbag. I, yeah. uh, yeah. I think the consensus was that in the NBA, they all say he was a piece of shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think it gets to the point where it's like, you know, people who are in their 30s and above. And you go meet a person and they say, stop the cap or something like that. A girl. That's you're like, know. oh, no. That's me, you know. yeah. No, you're not. The verbal <laughs> label, right? The verbal yeah, yeah. Label. Yo, dead ass FR, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No like, cap. No cap. It's like another land. Okay, so wait. Go back to the <laughs> 10 <laughs> organizations that never had yet to claim so an NBA the championship. Nets. Is the, oh, the Nets? Nah. Suns, Jazz, Nets, Magic, Pacers, magic? Hornets, yeah, magic, Grizzlies, magic. Clippers, Pelicans, and... Timberwolves. I was about to the Timberwolves. I thought they won. See, what a lot of those are all new, all new. Right. Timberwolves. Timberwolves uh, been around since the '90s. I was like, surprised yeah, but that. you hear what you said. '90s, right? Clippers. So that's still Clippers good. have been around. Clippers. Yeah, um, but Ballmer doesn't care because he may. And the Pacers. Pacers shocks me. And Magic. Magic's wow. been around. Yeah. No, the Magic is. I understand the Magic not making it after Anthony Hardaway left from. Yeah, and Shaq left. That was the opportunity. Yeah, not like Scott Skiles and who's the other guy they had here. I'm I'm dating myself by I fucking naming these guys. Who's gonna let you know? Wait, it was the '99 <laughs> Knicks that made the uh the finals. The the ones you talked about, which is like Larry Johnson and right was it? Oh wait, yeah, that's the one you talked about. Eight seed ones. No, I said uh, Spreewald can be Houston. Yeah, yeah, that was. That was way later. Not the Ewing championship. The Ewing championship was earlier. Well, the championship. That was me wishfully. <laughs> yeah, that was the 99. Right, with, uh, with uh, you so I'll try to read my history. Yeah. The Ewing championship back Later. then. <laughs> the troll was on there. Yeah. Yeah. Remember that? The speedwell rims? Spinning, they spinning, baby. Oh, they yeah. Spin. Jeez. <laughs> the speedwell. I feel old. Well, I said early 2000s. I didn't know that was 99. Oh, it's close enough. It's close. I'll give you yeah. that. Still, though, numbers mean 17, 18. <laughs> <laughs> Touche. Touche. Yeah, I've never heard anyone saying in the late but, 90s. You know what? You're not going to jail for this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I love how Patrick Ewing, uh, everyone on the roster has an American flag except Patrick Ewing, Jamaica. Yeah. Hell yes. Like Represent Jamaica. the career, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Jamaica. What I hate is the way the Knicks treat Ewan. Ewan should should have been on that coaching staff. Should have had an opportunity yeah. to actually coach. Uh, and then we treat him like he's no one. Right. Yeah. It's thrown away. Well, it should yeah. be though. Like, like, yeah, this dude should have a statue outside because he made New York relevant. They should have a statue, man. I'm. That's me. That's my yeah. opinion. But out front of a city field. <laughs> <laughs> put out into the building. Yeah, it's gonna be somewhere in the Bronx yeah. in an alleyway. <laughs> they, they don't really have much going on in, 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 in a city field with all those Mets. So let's put a let's, let's, put, some, let's put some hope in here. <laughs> no, it, it was weird about that, like Captain America statue to keep moving it around. Like the wall is at a uh, uh, industry 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 park, and they just keep moving it from like museum to museum. Which it's a Captain America statue. Oh, well, and it says, I'm, I'm just a boy from Brooklyn. They keep moving in places. Why? Well, why, why do we make a statue for exactly. Captain America? America? Exactly. Exactly. Like, and they, and they, no, but not even that, but they keep moving it. It's not like... And no one cares. Exactly. Yeah. So it's like, why do that? And you can't do one Patrick Ewing? Yeah. Try that. They probably, you know, uh, put one in Jamaica. 
No, all right, you want to talk about what the embassy used to be was like oh, oh yeah yeah and yeah. that one strip club down there was it, what was um, it called the uh, Dumbartons? What was it called? I just scouted it actually. You, know, you know, you know who owns that? Are we rep side now? No. Fucking back lot. It's like six feet. Strip club there. by the train track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it's no longer there. <laughs> oh, but no. I scouted it. I mean, I'm sorry, it's no longer. I operation. slept there one time. And it, yeah. and then walked out because they had way too many bullet holes for me. I, wa- I walked in. There, <laughs> I, know, I walked in there. And it was like dust everywhere. It was the saddest oh, thing. Man. And then. Right. Um, but That's yeah, you took people to learn how to drive. Step, yeah. You know, like, close, yeah, 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 sure. To the back over yeah. here, right off the BQ. <laughs> we gotta look at Chris Collinsworth. <laughs> Talk about. Just listen to this. No, oh, These girls really like you. I think probably because of the money, you know, and I'm not gonna deny it. I walk around with hundred dollar bills hanging out of my pockets usually, and that. Try and get it my best shot because before I ever made any money, it was pretty much uh, Big Nothing's Bill. Big I like Nothing's Bill. I like Grover Rocky because you can trick them a little bit. The sure. fucking Rocky is all up. That's, those are my big girls. And, uh, high school girls love me. You're 14 to 18. I'm a big star with them. As soon as they, you know, as soon as they even this after shit. After about 18 years Looks old. Looks about 40. Wait a minute. I know there's better oh, than that. No, I know there's that. Most people don't take me very seriously at all. You know, and I, I can't understand why. <laughs> <laughs> How is that not more like out there? When did that happen? I mean, we knew when that happened. It was the eighties, but sorry, the fact that he looks like Matthew Conhead. <laughs> 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 all right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> you know what they say about those high school girls? They say the same age. <laughs> I get old, they, they stay young. Stay. <laughs> 14 to 18. I do like them redheads. <laughs> Dude, the, 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 what, I think the line was improvised me. He's like, hey, kid, you got a joint? It's like, that would like, like, cooler if you did. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I think McConaughey looks like one of those guys where you, you'll just have a really good time just yeah. hanging out. Well, apparently he wasn't even, like that. they just made that role for him because they met him in Texas at a bar. And he's like, I'll, I'll be in the movie. And so they created that character, Watterson. Really? For Matt Nagana, and that's when he. I thought he got jumped off on uh, Texas uh, Chainsaw. I think that was after. That was after? Okay. Yeah, because oh, that, that, that movie came out like. 79? No, oh, yeah. Maybe like. It's a good year. Movie. when I was born. Ben Affleck's in there, debut in there. Like Daisy yeah. Confused? Daisy Confused? Daisy Confused was 90s. 90s? Right? Yeah. Yeah. Fairly certain. Oh, I'm thinking because it was just retro, because it was takes place in the 70s. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so you're. Yeah. Um, Texas Chainsaw. Yeah, break. Excuse me, guys. We right back. Wait, yeah. so he, so what, so that was, yeah, that was before. No, what Matthew was McConaughey after? was first in Unsolved Mystery. Yes, please. Um, Unsolved Mysteries. Is yeah, like Unsolved Mysteries. You don't know about how you, how you get a job there. The oh. the crypt? No. What's that? No. Unsolved Mysteries. No. Never saw it. No. Wow. Are you kidding me? You, you gotta go um, the twenty years of that right there. I think it's on. Um, Netflix now. Yeah, well, they rebooted it a few years ago. Oh, yeah. Really? Did you ever watch your own stuff now? I don't know. Yeah. Really? Oh, it's just like one of those crime shows. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's I like probably have. Have. Deep it's like, show. No, but it, it gets really, like, I think at that point in in the 90s, you got to think about it. In the 90s compared to now, you weren't exposed to as much as we are. Right. Meaning nothing's like, like you know, shocking anymore. The, yeah, nothing like we're all numb to the point. But in the nineties it's like you see unsolved mysteries and you get scared. Yeah. Because it like, actually is scary. You know? And, yeah. but it's like nowadays you watch and you're like Wait, why was Matthew McConaughey in Unsolved Mysteries? I guess he was starting out. His name was Larry Dickens. Hope you like that uh behind the scenes port for you. Oh, saw that? Yeah. You saw that? No, I heard it though. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mighty port. I don't, I don't get it. I don't understand. I mean, uh, coffee. I don't think. Uh, this is really black coffee. No milk. Extra foam. Of uh, Could look like a like a Coke, like a Pepsi or something. Could be a Pepsi, but then the bubbles should go down quicker. You know what makes me really nauseous and I can't drink anymore is like Coke. <laughs> I'm gonna listen to my music. He don't makes me nauseous. Women. <laughs> Put your microphone on. No, don't play music because I, I got in trouble with um, YouTube. What are you doing? 
going? I'm going into my quiet place. You went into your feelings. Mad. This song makes me feel better. Alright, I feel better now. What were we talking about? Oh, you were right. Uh, Days Confused was 93, Texas Chainsaw was 95. 95? Yeah. Was that, so that Texas Chainsaw, that was just like the sequel. Oh, it was like, like four. Four, four right? Yeah. yeah. You know, what, you know, I I told I always forget that Johnny Depp was in, uh, oh, Nightmare, Nightmare, yeah. 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 I always forget he's like he's like a twelve year old like Brad in that, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a he's good, a great actor. I fucking love. I don't him. care what anybody says. Oh no, I mean I think everyone I think the general consensus is like Amber Heard's kind of a piece of shit. Amber. I think I don't I don't know the true story, but no. But if she wants to call me, <laughs> yeah, right. I'm not gonna not pick up. She is so hot. Yeah, no, no, she no. is crazy. I remember, yeah. I remember until I you fucking wake up with shit on your pillow. Is that the craziest day. thing that ever happened? Come <laughs> so, so on, I think it's kind of hot. <laughs> she, crazy she, she kind of fucking hot. At least that was private. You know what I mean? It was like in the house, and then you just she's just like, you just like he like walks her on a leash. She's like takes a shit on the sidewalk yeah. naked. Do you, like, do you think that Johnny Depp cleaned the shit? No, no. he didn't. He has like twenty maids and he cleaned the poop. Do you think he's like officially British now? Do you think he has like an act? Like, I, I, know, like I don't know. Accent? Is that what he is? Well, know. he's from Ohio, but he has this like he's been in so many goddamn British movies with Tim Burton and like Harry Potter and whatever. But he's just like hi, like he's got to have a weird accent now. My favorite one is the Todd Sweeney. I love that movie. Sweeney Todd. Sweeney Todd. Yeah. Sorry. Edward Scissorhands. No. Edward Scissorhands. Edward Scissorhands. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. I'm trying to think. Oh, oh, Fear and Loathing. Mm. Good movie. I never saw that one. So long, Sweet Todd. Sweet Todd's good. Yeah. I'm trying to think uh, another Tim Burton movie. That, I mean, of course, all the claymation ones he's in. Those are all great. Oh, well, we're going to Tim Burton. Tim Burton's. I oh, think he's a Fat Man. Fat. Uh, oh, uh, Beetlejuice. Oh, uh, Beetlejuice. Michael Keaton. Yeah. Are, aren't they doing another one? Uh, yeah, they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They are. That's and Michael and still uh, Michael Keaton Wednesday, too. Wednesday, uh, the girl who played Wednesday. Michael Keaton. And Michael Keaton is still Beetlejuice. Oh right? yeah, what's the name? Uh, or, 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 Jenna, Jenna or Jenna or Jenna or Jenna or so hot and they bring him uh, wine on the back too right yeah she's yeah. really I yeah. think I think it's like a she's family. like you know I forgot about she's like the mom she's like the daughter mm-hmm. yeah I forgot about her until Stranger Things happened great right. great show I it. got stuck on it I like it dude you know who played I Hopper Hopper oh yeah Hopper. yeah yeah I saw him in real life in Brooklyn yeah not yeah. shooting just walking walking the street yeah and like Red Guardian. Look, like walking, but not with a like a speed walking, right. not with a purpose. Like he's just strolling down the street. Yeah. Tall. And I think I think at, 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 at a certain point he's, like, he's like tall. a middle middle aged white guy in Brooklyn now. Well, like, it's like, right? <laughs> I think I think with celebrities at this point, like if they're like if they're walking and they see you look at them, they acknowledge you. They hear that. Yeah, like the, yes. Well, it's probably exactly. also it's kind of funny too. He's, he's he's kind of like that perfect like thread of the needle of a kind of like a celebrity where he's not too. It's a David Arbor, David Harbor, I think it's his yes. name. Yes, yeah. But he funny. like he isn't like a household name, nor is he like well well known. So he probably gets to threads that line where he's not like being chased down by he's paparazzi. Guardian. It's like, like I'm walking down the street. That's all right. Right. All right. Oh, I mean, I'm cool. officially a, I'm about to be a starlet. So, so starlet. Yeah. Yes. You? Yeah, I'm gonna be a beautiful starlet. We we went. We talked about this. Did we? Know. Eighty five pounds in plastic. That's right. That's right. That's right. And Barbie. The heroin. The heroin. The heroin. heroin. Eighty five yeah. pounds. Yeah, probably. Yeah, he wants to do the the weekend's uh, next uh, series on HBO. Oh, <laughs> I want to look at Jerry Leto. <laughs> no, uh, Matthew McConaughey and uh, fucking Dallas. Idol. 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 Idol season two. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're gonna look like, uh, what's his name? Christian Bale. Christian Bale and the Machinist. Oh my god. Oh, no, I mean, come on. Yeah. Christian Bale's a man. He ate, I think, like an apple and like cigarettes. That was his diet. Yeah. Like, really? Day. Yeah. yeah I, I tried that. that. didn't work. An me. apple and cigarettes. <laughs> Dude, we're from the Caribbean. You can't fucking just live off that shit. <laughs> Too much fucking good I, food. I, I, I did. Um, Can you imagine not eating rice and beans? So here's the problem. So hungry. Not the problem. Oh, the issue. The issue is I'm doing the whole diet thing where all I eat is it's like I don't eat carbs. I cut it out. I no, well no, let me just say this correctly. I don't eat rice, bread, um grain. 
Any grains. grains. Don't eat any of that. You know how hard that is for me? Especially in New York. Oh. Don't you have Puerto Rican All rice? I ate was rice. <laughs> All I ate was rice growing up. Yeah. Like anything and everything I have, give me rice. We used to order, when I was younger, order Popeye chicken. I'll eat Popeye's chicken and white rice. Not yeah. potatoes? Not, no. not potatoes? No, do. I like my rice. I still do. It's carbs on carbs. I mean, what's better than that? I want lasagna, rice. Ooh. It's yeah, but you know how hard it is to fucking live your life now. Well, also in New York too, especially if you don't want to cook and yeah. you want to order. It's, yeah, it's like you have to get carbs. It's almost like an necessity. You know, it becomes like bread or rice. Right, like, oh, right. pizza, um, tacos, burritos, rice. I have, not, no, I have not come to that crossroad in my life where I. I I did it to the point yeah. where like you know what it actually like inflammation. Um, I had I had really bad gout. Your face says look better. Inflammation. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All that stuff. I'm pulling out first one. Yeah. It all went away. I don't feel that shit no more. So it's like, I feel good. But I made a bad decision and I had pizza. The first weekend of this year, because the kids wanted pizza, we bought pizza and I was like, I'm going to have one slice. One slice. <laughs> the next day, gout. Yeah. I'm yeah. like, oh my god! It's because your body's not. It, it was. It was funny when the, when you're off of carbs for a long time, and then you have that one slice of pizza. Your body just be like, oh, yeah. we're gonna store this. So yeah. they blow you. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're like, oh my god, where you been on? But I can't quit. Five months. <laughs> no, no. I mean, listen. I don't. I don't think that beer, as much as anybody would say, oh, you got, you should stop drinking. You stop drinking. I don't think liquor, to a certain extent, mm. in consumption. Uh, not the way I do. <laughs> Same. Water. <laughs> but see, that's what I do. I do that, and then I do my water. I don't yeah. have. I don't have soda. I don't have fucking yeah. juice. Well, it's, I mean, like, soda some, has like, like seventy yeah, grams shit. of sugar. Where beer, I mean, probably has like. You know, it's way less. Cars, it's the yes. only thing I drink: water and beer. Beer. Yeah. yeah. And liquor. Coffee. And liquor. And coffee. Yeah, and I don't mix my liquor. If I'm gonna I have a, a whiskey, it's it's neat. Yeah. There's no ice cube, there's no soda, there's no juice. You do whiskey neat? Always. Good, good man. Badass. No, that's the way you're meant to be consumed. I want to I get it to scotch. Right, that's the best yeah. way. Yeah, just so, straight up neat. Scotch. Yeah, but you can't touch it. I know, but I'm saying I want, I, want, I want to wean my way into getting to scotch. No, I can do liquor. Can't do both. And you know how much I love my beer. I can't do beer and liquor. You can't do beer and liquor. No, that's why I can't do uh, shots. I, I, I can do shots right of there. liquor and chase it with beer. Yeah, I do it. I do this, and then I get my whiskey neat. That's my so you, chase. Just yeah. get rid of that that well, palate flavor. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Does, yeah, does. no, no. I mean, that's that's my problem. Like, I like normally I start out, you know, to do like maybe three, four beers, and then you know, if a shot's <laughs> present. I'm like, all right, I'll take a shot. And then that's when the beer's like, oh, we don't like this at all. Oh, no. And then, you know, and then if I want to do more beer, more beer, it's the alcohol, the liquor is still in me. It's not happy with me whatsoever. I throw it off. I, I always started off with one of these. Oh, my phone died? Yeah, your phone died. Uh, <laughs> how did your phone die? Because it wasn't uh, charged. What a whiskey yeah. neat. One of these. No water. I'll have three things right here. Boom, boom. And that's why my whole situation. You know what I love about uh I'm sorry, man. You know what I love about it's like airport fucking beverages. We have like beer, orange juice, coffee, water, bloody mary. It's like this the uh, the fucking five unity rings. They're the infinity sounds <laughs> of an airport. Infinity rings. Yeah. It's Rob, welcome to the podcast. If not any other podcast. Will's phone has to fuck up, and he has a new phone. I know. He has a new. We phone. We didn't know their podcast before this. <laughs> that's that's why that's why that happened because I and then, and then what, the first no, time I showed up. Don't blame me on me. I was charging it in that, in that fucking thing while we were while we were hanging uh, out. Uh, your box sucks. Yeah, I'm blaming it on the box. <laughs> I was it was it was it was in there. It was plugged in. I don't know if it was charging. Oh, but could have uh, been like hanging loosely. Yeah. When, it's, it's, the, the, the octagon over there of all the different plugs. Yeah. It looks very fire hassle. <laughs> it, I, 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 how hot is that, Devin? <laughs> He's like, uh, yeah. oh, God. Are yeah. we dying? No, I'm not dying. This table's not going to set off on fire. fire. 
marks in the bottom right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, so a little burnt marks to, to match the uh, oh, coffee yeah, stain, yeah. baby. Like, you know, oh, yeah, water, right. water stains. That's yeah, what happens yeah. with these things. We, wait, how long have you been doing the show for? I don't know. What time you started? Um, we're about what, 75 minutes in. Oh, yeah. Oh. Let's, let's call it. Let's record the day. Get some food. I'm hungry, dude. I don't know. I think you guys ordered Chipotle already, man. Uh, he wanted to order after the show. Oh, yeah. no, I'm good, dude. I'm, I gotta go to bed. Yeah, I know. I, I, <laughs> I'm like, I don't blame you. I mean, no, I could continue going. But the, the minute I go, I'm gone. I'm gone. Come on. Yeah. At first until. Oh. <laughs> you need it, man. You just fucking need it. Yeah. We, should, we should just do quarter of the day, and then and then it's be done in an hour and 15. Let's do another, do another 20. Come on. Another 20? Yeah. Uh, yeah. this is the next time your motherfuckers gonna invite me over again. I mean, honestly, like we should, three months. <laughs> I'm surprised we haven't had it sooner. Oh, you know, fucking life and family and shit. Yeah. No, no. Calvin did invite me over, but then what the fuck did I have to do not too long ago? The first time you guys told me, you told me. I don't know. I I think I had some family. It was probably some like my maybe my niece was dancing and doing a little thing, and I had to go to that. I think that's what it was. Really? You know, like. Yeah, you know, they buy tickets. So I don't show up. Nah. And I, I love my little niece, so. I like seeing her dance. Where she? She's like a little school recital school? thing. And all. Oh, yeah. I don't recall. Yeah, I think that's what it was. I don't recall. Are, are you kidding? Or oh, maybe I was just giving you bonus points. <laughs> you gave me that look. Like, you, you gave me that look. It was like, no, that's what it was. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'm just okay, throwing yes, it. Sir. Yes, like, yes, right. yes. I wasn't at the strip club. I mean, dancing. <laughs> I mean, that kind of dance. I'm just fucking making up excuses for you now. Like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What's so your I, niece's name? Diamond. <laughs> <laughs> so I could Last name Silk. So. Diamond Silk. So, so I couldn't make it to the 2 p.m. show. I was at a strip club. Until <laughs> 2 a.m. <laughs> That's hilarious. How, how is this working with the mic now situation? Mics are good. We got professional mics. Okay, yeah. There we go. I just took that one and pop it on me. It was, everything's dying nowadays. Yeah. Well, it's meant to die. So yeah, you can go true. buy more shit. That is true. All this shit is for. That is you true. You have that next cell. That shit never died. Remember that thing? Yeah. That thing never died. You can throw it at somebody and use it and bring it back and put it in your pocket. It was a weapon. You knew yeah. when that wasn't on your person. Mm-hmm. You knew when the next cell wasn't on you because rock. you don't feel that weight anymore. <laughs> You're like, where the fuck did it go? <laughs> where did my brain go? <clears throat> you leave. Yeah, well, but, but think about it, though. Think about it, though. Those next tells back then in the days, right? How many times did you use it? The only time you pulled it out was to, was to make a phone call. No, Not, I don't even know why I did this. I tripped. Because uh, you didn't text. See, see, I'm older. I had the, the yellow one, the old school yellow with the gray. Or the black box. I know what you're talking about. Remember that. So yeah, yeah. you chirped like a motherfucker. We were chirping. You know, you was in the other car, and your boy was in that car. Uh, and you just like, hey, we getting off this. It was all day. It's like a walkie. Boost it was. Mobile had so it that. Was construction. Yeah, was next up went to Boost. Right? Yeah, and then next up took the mobile. So I, I mean, was at work one day, and Vanessa likes doing this shit to me where she chirps me, and I was in the. Uh, I was working at Party City, and I'm in the back in the locker room, just changing into my work clothes. All of a sudden, she ch- chirps me. She's like, hey, where you at? I'm at work. Uh, I was like, I'm changing. And then she's like this, are you naked right now? And it's <laughs> like <laughs> loud in the oh, back. Shit. I'm like, no. That was, dumb, that was literally the fucking pitfall of that shit. <laughs> you just sit there, and somebody just starts yelling at your fucking head. Yeah. Yo. <laughs> You, you're like, I remember sorry, that shit. sorry, sorry. My, I got cheek is talking. No, I got, got shit. Shit. <laughs> why all the mob bosses died. And like the- no, but those phones were so tough, dude. We got into an argument one time about the cell phone situation, and I took my cell phone. And I was like, Yo, you, you want to get fucking mad at me about this? I was like, Fuck this cell phone. I took it and I threw it in the street. Through it, it bounced back and hit you. The battery, <laughs> and then like you know, you know when you when you when 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 the passion's gone, when you when you're heated, you know yeah. you're angry and you, you do something, and then you're like, Shit, why did I do that? Go back, pick the phone up, not a scratch, yeah, okay. <laughs> not a scratch. Yeah, no, do this shit. <laughs> that thing oh, done. Four pieces, and unless you see just enough, 
yeah. the messages that you can't open. Yeah. It. And, and then like, it sends a message to Apple, and Apple's like, all right, we got him. <laughs> come <laughs> back. Hey, there's this place on Madison Ave that I want you to come check out. It's so I got you. You miss bad. us? Yeah. You know, Madison, we can go downtown. Talk to me. Talk to me. <laughs> Talk to me. All right, here's what we're going to do, Rob. You are Bobby Two Bears. That's my name. What is your top five beers? Boys, you want to your this. top five. Top five beers. Now, here's the thing. It don't have to be in order of importance. It doesn't have to be ranked. I, it's I just definitely your top five. not going to do that. Um, I, party-wise, in, in the sense of like, readily accessible shit a heineken you can always find that anywhere mm-hmm. any bar you go to any household you go to a lot of heineken, somebody right? bought a heineken it's yeah. just like yo cool i'm gonna just grab this heineken is it my favorite no is it there yes it's also not <laughs> it doesn't get you as fucked up so if i have to like leave from there if i could have five six of those mm-hmm. i'm okay the rest of the day i'm not slouching and running off and stuff like that um can i tell you what i don't like coronas what fucking trash to me that's just my, that's my fucking that's my mouth. Mouth. <laughs> oh, no, it's good because if, if we're hanging out you're not gonna take my coronas it, it's good it's all yours <laughs> i'll buy it from you. So you won't drink my stuff <laughs> um yes i like a good ipa but i'm i'm fine with a good lager um <clears throat> I, I i like a good sam Regular Sam. I, I, I like the moderate generic stuff. Does that make sense when like, I say that? Like Coors. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Color. Like I would drink a, a Coors Banquet, but I wouldn't drink a Coors Light. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. You know I mean? I'm there you with you. I'm there with you. I yeah. don't like I don't like a Coors Light. Gotcha. I mean, if that's all we have now is Coors Light, hey, I'm not going to tell you no. If you put it in my hand, I'm going to drink it. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. Um, will I sip on it slowly? Very slowly. And I can Probably two beers... Yeah. I, I I drink them. Now here's a good post that you bought me. You got me uh, Coney Island. Coney Island makes good stuff. I'm not here plugging them. They have a good Merman IPA. Yeah. I don't know if you guys that's good. That's that no, no, no. really yeah, good. Yeah. It's tasty. Not all IPAs taste good, by the way. There's no, IPAs yeah, that taste like too fucking floral. Yes. Yeah. yeah, it's like Literally. the actual worship. Yeah, like, like they they right. they brewed it with manure. Yeah. Here here here, it's been through this fucking land and it tastes like. Ass crack and dog shit and then horse shit. Mm. And it's like, oh, this is disgusting. You you get a good hazy Sierra Nevada is good. They got yeah. a good hazy. Yeah. Um local breweries, six point brewery. Yeah. They make some good stuff. Obviously Brooklyn does also. And I like the fact that these are all local stuff. I, yeah. I prefer local mm. places. Only invest like within to, the economy. Well, also, yeah. And also, not only that too, but also it tastes better when it's right here. Yes. It's not like, you know, going from truck to truck to, truck, to market to, truck, yeah. to whatever. And, and there's some great stuff from LA, but obviously it might be a produced series, stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I could go to Brooklyn like, Brewery and buy this shit right there because it's being brewed literally right there. Do you like Brock, PCPC? Yes, I yeah. do. I love it. It's right next to me, it's, actually. Yeah. It's, it's right next to Silver Cup right there. You just yeah. come down the bottom, <clears throat> have a good beer. It's two blocks away. Yeah. While you work in there, you have to go to lunch. <laughs> go to lunch. I'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> you can't tell me what my diet is. If it's liquid diet, it's a liquid, liquid diet. diet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a liquid diet. It's, this good <clears throat> stuff out there, it is, especially in our boroughs. Shit, dude, even in Long Island, they got good stuff. You can mm-hmm. get a good Montauk, you know? Montauk's great. Yeah, it's, yeah. You don't have to leave here in New York City to New York State. Mm-hmm. Go upstate. Dude, great they, vineyards they up there, too. Plenty of vineyards yeah. and all this and stuff. And Long Island, too. I mean, yeah. over in Greenport. You, you can make a whole day out of bar, uh, brewery hopping in yeah. all upstate and just be an hour and a half, two hours away. How are you hopping? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell How you. How are you I'm, hopping? No, no, no. We rented a vehicle. Who's driving? Rented a vehicle. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. There was a designated driver. Because if you're upstate New York, you ain't hopping, hey, you're driving. There's a designated driver who does not want to partake in the drinking, but partakes in all the eating. Yeah, uh, yeah always. I was like, yo, we fucking got you. Uh, yeah, man. we'll buy you food. We're going to buy you food. You're going to watch us get fucked up and just have a good time. Until they get food high. <laughs> I can't. I'm don't so tired. Sleepy, bro. Bro. Yeah, don't get sleepy. <laughs> Yo, so wait. Go. So we're gonna go back to your top five. So Heineken. Uh, 
Yes, a, a good hiney is good. A good hiney. Uh, <laughs> Drink a um, hiney, slap a hiney. Slap a hiney. I slap so many hineys. I, I like a good. I, I like a good Brooklyn leg. Again, I, I like I like all the local stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm all, I'm big on Montauk's. Also, if I see a wave chaser, I like wave chasers. Yeah, yeah. Uh, these are all all year round stuff, so you don't have to worry about it be seasonal. Yeah, I'm not a big seasonal guy. Like yeah. these old these winter lags too heavy for yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. And it has it's we almost got one of this today. We almost got one. Uh, see, it's like having a meal. It's man. a good thing a I didn't get it. It's a uh, good thing. You just uh, feel like you're like sitting on rocks. Yeah. God. You have one. It's like, oh, shit, I just had a porterhouse. <laughs> so it feels like. I want a porterhouse so bad. Yeah, I'd rather have a porterhouse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like you said, Casey, good stuff. You could go to Six Point and get some good stuff. This well, so other, other half. Things. I do like other half yeah, yeah. too. I actually, I never, I don't, I don't remember other half as well. But I, Mermaid Tail is probably my go-to. I, I like going to Coney Island yeah. and having the Coney Island. Coney yeah. Island. I, I mean, what, how dope is that? Yeah, you can just go down dope. there and watch a baseball game at the bar. Uh, go I, downstairs and have I a beer. I didn't realize that it's, the baseball stadium is right on the fucking boardwalk. It's. Right I did not realize. Right I, I went to Coney Island for the first time like two summers ago, and I, you know, drove by. I was like, "Are you fucking? Kidding? That's sick." Right there. Coney the Island has everything you need. You can go to the beach, get on a fucking ride, go catch a baseball game, get a beer, a beer. go on a road, yeah. <laughs> go on a roller coaster, yeah. throw up, and find a crackhead, yeah. find a crackhead, and go to the uh, aquarium. Yeah, the aquarium's oh, cool. Yeah. And get a good hot dog. Yeah, same time. You That's know what? You know what's so weird? Oh, 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 oh. The Brighton Beach area is so weird to me. I like so I like Brighton Beach. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you ever eat one of those restaurant uh, Russian restaurants? I don't Russian think so. restaurants, oh, man. Dude, oh, I had oh. to scout a bunch of tea rooms, a bunch of Russian oh, uh, there. Uh, bars, and it's like, dude, it's amazing. It's they're so friendly, no. by the way. What? Very they hated me. They hated I me. scouted. I had to go like, scout see, Russian <laughs> bars. They had to make sure they had to be extra happy. <laughs> you know what I think it is, though? I think with Russians, well, I don't, you, I don't know. People might take this negative when I say it not a russian by anybody else but i think with russians and what i learned was every russian bar i went to they all had different infused vodkas which was like but it's like when i went there they're like this oh come here come. and start pouring me like different try this try this try this try this yeah that was my and experience it, it, yeah. exactly and i think they you know russians are like you know come witness engulf yourself within you know, the community, the our, culture, yeah, our like culture. Uh, what we do. Really, you know? I, they were very yeah. selfish to me. Uh, really, yeah. what you do, man? What you I do, was man? knocking on doors, yeah. which did not help because we're looking for an apartment. No, I always oh, see that's what you no. do. You was going to apartments. You was going to restaurants. Oh, we were going. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah. we they wanted an apartment right by the the by, by the uh, the Ferris wheel, and mm-hmm. of course the closest apartment's really there at Brighton Beach. And I was not having any projects. Over the projects. Yeah, the projects. Yeah, I actually got yeah, into I got into apartments in the project. Right across from the aquarium. Nope. No, not that one. Oh. Uh, further, uh, uh, I guess, what is that? East? Okay. Uh, so, like, I, I don't I don't know the number of streets. That was, mm-hmm. But I think uh, it was, anyway, it was, like, closer to the baseball stadium. Um, but they, they were actually, a lot of them were, like, like garden apartments. And they owned the, they owned the whole, like, town. Well, you know, once you go past uh, Surf and you go up to the other block, that's just yeah. ghetto as hell. Dude, yeah. so, <laughs> I can't believe, I can't believe. <laughs> Warriors! <laughs> come <laughs> out to play! <laughs> bottles just not <laughs> yeah i was I, I can't believe i was doing oh, that speaking of nitro you hear what happened with them so nitro has a bunch of supers and all this stuff that run these buildings so in these buildings something needs to get fixed they're done to it then they would hire contractors outside contractors okay. what these supers were doing saying hey we gotta fix up plumbing here and then will as a certified company you have a certified company but will's like and you're the employee uh you're not sure i'm not sure okay i'm coming to hire it was like five thousand dollars i'm like okay great and you're like i can do it for three thousand dollars oh great did i do this put it for five did i do this Yep. Mm. Ah, see, I saw you was going there with that. Oh, motherfuckers. 
So it's crazy. So now it's a whole big corruption. They, the federal government's in this now, like just really? taking them off See? on who were making these deals. Yeah. Like it, it's insane. Huh. So. That's my next story. story. Oh, we do. Oh, we do. Yeah. Yeah. Just like, just like fucking, like, uh, you know, what's funny too? Hard, well, you're, you're, Wells Fargo you're a New York native. Yeah. But well, now you, you live in Jersey. Yeah. But here's I still the thing, care. Though, but you still work in New York yeah. though, sometimes, right? I still right? care. And now you still got to pay New York taxes. I do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're yeah. in there. Like, yeah. it's just like. Well, that was me too. <laughs> Which New York. You see your fucking Chucky, you're like, New York, oh, New York and Jersey. So Fuck bad. you guys. <laughs> I'll wait for Connecticut to just stick their hand in too. Like, yeah. Yo, yeah. Just because. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> First thing, bitch. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, shit, dude, here, go ahead. Take tri state tax. <laughs> it's just $10. Hours. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, it's going to be a tri state tax. So. Yeah. You know, not for real. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I go. 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 It's for the real warriors. <laughs> You're like, shit, we just. Give you guys a heads up. <laughs> yeah, famous off of fake news. I would not be surprised for that to, mm. to happen, though. I would not, no, not be surprised. I wouldn't, I wouldn't yeah. be surprised. I moved out. I moved out so far. I mean, look, look so at fast. The, uh, the new... What's that shit? The toe thing, though? The fucking thing that you do? Oh, yeah. If you're coming That's down insane. from, like, 59th or down into oh, yeah. the void yeah. congestion. You yeah. can't come into 15. the city anymore. Yeah. It's, I heard Jersey's, like, pissed off about that. Why wouldn't it be? Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I gotta come in and it'll cost me fucking twenty five dollars to get to downtown. Is it also to leave going. too? Do you have to pay the no, toll? No, I to think once it, it, it reads your tag, once you pay that that toll for the day, it's for the day. But oh, I, okay. But I think you can work uh, around still, it too. Still. If you stay on the west, west side, side or the FDR and you just not going into into the area, yeah. then they don't charge you. But the minute you, you start know crossing, happen, right? It's gonna create traffic. No matter what, oh, yeah, this people there, it's gonna be like, yeah. I'm, gonna, I'm I'm traveling up east now. Let me travel all the way far west, right? Go up north, travel it, back. Yeah. You know, it's like it, it's a it's, noble reason, but the way they're going about it is just fucking absolutely stupid. It's gonna it's gonna go back. I to get why we want to alleviate uh, traffic, right? Well, but the way you, I do mean, they're it, framing like, it. They're framing. They're framing it, it as alleviating. Well, yeah, and we all know it's really just to pay off all the fucking pensions that they're giving away to all these MTA people because they all retiring at the age of eighty. MTA where, is just which you know what, good for them. They get your money, dude. I'm not mad at that. I, I just want to yeah. know, like, what? We all union people. We no all know. <laughs> like, I want to see a breakdown. But you won't ever see that. That's what I'm saying. You, it's like, why can't we see a breakdown? Most of it goes to bonuses to the top heads, right? Because, you know, even though it's a not-for-profit organization yeah, and all that yeah. shit, you, you still, you know, my salary is, you know, one million, but, you know, here's this three million bonus because I've been such a <laughs> great yeah. job yesterday. Yeah, right. And then all the pensions that you have to pay for accordingly because, hey, you know what? They earned that. But there's no service work. Just come back, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. You build a tunnel. It takes you fucking 20 years to build a tunnel. You fucking kidding me? Yeah. It doesn't take 20 fucking years, yeah. but that I got construction to the job and retire off that job. Yeah. Uh -huh. That construction job used to take X amount of time, but now that construction company is milking the shit out well, of it. Well, here's, here's the thing. I, I what? Staten Island. I'm shooting in Staten Island, and it was Staten Island Expressway, and all of a sudden there was this construction company down there fixing the road. They're fixing the road in the jackhammer. Right? Locations, we need to stop the sound. I'm the unit PA. Calvin, go down there and tell them to stop. I go down and tell the guys to stop. Tell them to stop. Well, I asked. Stop now. Or <laughs> no, 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 no. Can you see this piece I got on me? I, I, I'm and kill this walking. these guys are like, sure, we'll stop. I was like, oh, great. Wow, they're really nice people. Uh, wow, this is amazing. So they stopped. They waited. They were just smoking their cigarettes, cigars, you know, just hanging out. And then the guy was like, hey, kid, you want to see something? And I was like, yeah, you show me the pothole that they're fixing. Do you see this pothole? It's like, yes. He's like, we don't fix it all the way. I was like, well, why? What, huh? <laughs> He's like, through the seasons, and construction guys only call it two seasons, winter and summer. Summer. <laughs> <laughs> right? yeah. Fall. 
winter and summer. When we've put the asphalt down, it's summertime now, it's good. In the wintertime, we don't put, in the summertime, we fix the big ones, but we don't fix the little cracks. Normally, we fix the big and the cracks. You don't fix the cracks because in the, in the wintertime, that crack now expands, expands and becomes bigger. So then we get a chance to come back now, and that's how we keep, keep working. working. Yeah. So I was like, holy shit. It's, it's the biggest fucking case. Science. Is, there's science to this. Mm-hmm. I went, I got, well, I don't have it anymore. I had my extermination once. Yes. I was going to be an exterminator once in my life. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> it still is. I mean, shit. So it is. If I lived in a building, man. We went. <laughs> we went, I went to this school, not a school, it's like a little basement when you go in there. And they, they, they teach you, you do not kill all of the bugs. You do not kill all of the rodents. You kill enough to show that you've killed enough where no one sees anything. And you wait until the infestation comes back. Then you get called again in a couple of months. But then, but then, do you, would they even be called again though if he keeps coming back? Because then clearly, well, that's why Orchard didn't hire his ass anymore. Else. <laughs> <laughs> well, they, you do it to the point where it's like you get one, two, three calls back, and then that's it. They just go out to find another yeah. client. Yeah, but that's that's the game. The game is uh, how long have they been fixing the uh, Long Island Express right? since I was born. Oh, jeez, I was born in 1979. Since they built it, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, and contract, <laughs> and that shit is never is never end. Never yeah. ends. It's just a fucking long game. <laughs> Good from them, like you said. Like yeah, I was saying, long game. I'm here. To, I'm gonna do this job, and I'm gonna retire on this job. It's gonna be thirty years, and I'm gonna be like, I'm out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. My kid's coming in, and he's gonna fucking take over. I, I, like, yeah. I feel like, like, what is the breakdown? Because it's like, how many cars are getting speeding tickets? How many cars are getting parking tickets? How many blah 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 blah? Right? Sanitation, giving out tickets to people that haven't cleaned their sidewalks or. Well, like, where's see, all this money? Who, like, well, where's all this money going? And who's it being paid to? You're right. And it, it gets paid to the city, the state, whatever it is. But the problem with that shit is where it's concentrated. So you see all these cameras that we have, right? Where are the cameras? All important neighborhoods. All important neighborhoods. If you go to Long Island, there ain't no fucking speed traps over there. Mm. You go to, I don't know, name another affluent fucking neighborhood. There's no speed cameras there either. Where do you see speed cameras? The hood. Drive up and down Atlantic. Atlantic Ave. Oh, full of speed traps. Linden Boulevard alone from when you get off the conduit till you get to, I don't know, Pennsylvania Ave. No. Well, it's like seven. Well, I'll, I'll tell you. I'll, I'll tell That's you not even now. two miles. I don't I don't really think it's it's hood. No. Because, it is. It's no, because like Northern Boulevard, Woodhaven, Cross Bay. Okay, no the Boulevard. Jackson but Heights. No. It's still, it's still... This is what they do. It's not that. It's not that. The cameras are putting out, right? This is what they do in the like the hood areas. They have these Ford Escapes, all white. And when you look on top of it, it's a black bar, flashlight, and camera. So now, a person comes from the city, drives it, Parks the car, and when the cop when the cars are speeding, and then that car leaves. Now, right? They go for like when they know when it's the most time okay. they go there, and then they go to another neighborhood, park the car there, and leave. They have these mobile speed traps. So, so why don't they do that in other neighborhoods? When I say other neighborhoods, Upper East Side, oh, Montclair, affluent neighborhoods. Why don't they do that? Because who's there? really speeding there, though? Dude, everybody's speeding. You, you kidding me? Go to those neighborhoods. You think those drunk, drunk rich people are now fighting? I've, I've, I've seen flying? an angry. I've seen an angry mm. housewife speeding down her Escalade before. Yeah, yeah. Doing oh, I know the t- I know the trick on driving on the streets. The trick to me is just fucking do twenty five everywhere I'm going. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't even say it. I'm gonna say it off camera, huh? Because huh? I don't want to put it out there, and all of a sudden, don't give it away. Don't it. Away. Then all of a sudden, it's mm-hmm. like. Man. All of a sudden, the city is like, "Oh no, we're gonna do it." You know, like, uh, it's like the guy that the scratch. It's a number scratch, game. But... We say it, it's a number game, and I, I did this. It's number always game. all numbers. It's, it's, it's. What's a speedometer number game? I'll tell you after. <laughs>
when we're done. Okay, okay, okay. It's okay. it's like ask okay. me what the magic number is. And I'll so so we're pra- we're practically in Vegas and we're just like gambling our lives. It's crapshoot. <laughs> no, no, it's not. It's not. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, there's a certain number of uh, s- certain number of speed. But you still take speed. a chance. You still can take it. Uh, we're still. Oh, I'm still there. I forgot you guys started way oh. earlier than me. Thank you guys for waiting for me. Dude, yeah, no, waiting at all. Yeah, long. You know. Was, uh, yeah, Will was showing us his duck walk moves. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, That's was it Terrell's duck? duck. Well, but he no, he did the duck walk. Uh, Terrell uh, waddles. Uh, he duck walks. Uh, he does the D walk. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do quarter day? Um, let's see. Let's see. Oh, oh me? I'm grabbing another one. If you, are still going. Well, I think we're gonna we're gonna do our quote of the day. Oh. Yeah, yeah boy. I'm calling. It's like, huh? Check this shit out. Yeah, this out, man. Go ahead. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Thank you, though. Three, three. Where's IBU? Where do you see that? It's below, next to the oh. 5.2%. All right, I, I don't three really pay attention IBU. to that shit, but 5.2 is good. Exactly. That's, 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 that's it's like, uh, it's, it's, it's like right above medium. Yeah, like a, I like, like a, a beer. Yeah, I like a beer. Yeah, it's like a Corona is like a four. Yeah, three point five, three, four, yeah, four, four something like but that. No, but those beers are like three point nine, and I'm like, why? Why, why am I? Here? And, and just to like be clear, like when I go to Puerto Rico and shit, um, I drink a medalla. Right? Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I'm in Puerto Rico. I'm drinking a medalla. Medalla is fucking Corona. Yeah. But guess what? I'm here. So whatever. Mm-hmm. They do have some good breweries there though. Believe it or not, Puerto Rico got some fucking yeah. dope ass breweries, man. Beer do taste different in, in other the countries. I'm, yes, I've it's had sweet. a Guinness Stout here in the U.S. and I had a Guinness Stout in Guyana, and it's totally different. Yeah, and when you look at the back of the bottle for a Guinness Stout in Guyana, where's the brew in Guyana? And you're like, holy shit, it just they, tastes. Better well, probably the water. Well, for you some could, reason, probably. Not, the water, the hops, the, water. the hops grow there differently mm. as well. Mm. Y'all got breweries too that I've been trying to hit. I have not gone there to hit those. I've had a couple beers from there, and I'm like, I was very impressed. But Puerto Rico fucking really has some great shit. Mm. And old San Juan. Hey, when you, you go, go to the uh, Bacardi uh, factory, you get drunk off of just being in there. Smelling the fumes. That's Probably. Nice. We'll go to the Brugai factory at the same time. Brugal. Oh, well, they, they go like this. Every, every time you stop. Well, Will, like, here. Here, here, here. here. <laughs> I'm, gonna try, I'm just going to charge my phone. We're gonna, uh, well, we're going to do this real quickly. It's dead. All right. It's like a kid, you know? Well, I thought you were hungry. I thought you were going to go. I'm hungry. I'm, I'm tired. Starving. My brain is like, it's yeah. like. And he says you're going to go run. Yeah. I'm going to go, go run. I'm going to eat, go <laughs> run. He's not going to Bad. Somebody put a track on you. <laughs> like a bit of march. Like our s- two hours of podcast. Listen, yeah, I'm allowed to go to bed. Right? Like, you I'm the only one that has an excuse here. <laughs> I know. Normally, what we do at the end of all these podcasts is we always end it with a quote. And uh, I would just ask if you, you know, once I say the quote, just you know, see who you think would say this quote. The quote goes like this: Milk is for babies. When you grow <laughs> up, you have to drink beer. Frederick Douglass. <laughs> ah, I knew it. It's got to be. Freddie said it. Who did it? You think Freddie D? Yeah. Freddie D said it. Who else could it be? You got me. <laughs> it wasn't Freddie? It wasn't Freddie? It's got to be Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Man, fuck. I was so close. You just beer guy? That's a, yeah. I was so fucking close. He was a beer guy. You were, actually. I thought it was close. <laughs> Let me turn it off. Oh yeah, you gotta hold 